Welcome to Third Day Reviews. I am Justin, and today we are taking a look at a Naked Armor shave brush that they sent me in not one kit, but actually in two different kits. Like all of their kits, it comes in a nice little packaging here. Once you take the lid off, you end up seeing all the products that these kits come with. You can also buy the shave brush on its own, and we'll get into the price at the end of the video. The shave brush features a sandalwood handle with a chrome end cap. Now we all know that the most important part of a shave brush is the bristles. And I tell you what, I had a hard time telling if it was synthetic or natural hair. It acts like a natural hair. In fact, I even had a few of the hairs come out when I first got it. And I usually only get that with natural hair brushes. However, I contacted the company and I was actually surprised to find out that it is a synthetic brush that is actually made out of a product that is called Futura Synth. And it is basically a high heat tolerant fiber that should actually outlast a lot of the natural hair brushes that I have. Now my experience using this brush is that it makes a pretty good lather and I definitely think that that is because of the little bit stiffer bristles that this has. It does a really good job of really being able to beat up that lather to get a really nice thick lather like you would probably like. Now it's not quite as soft when you are applying it to your face. However, it's soft enough that it's not going to scratch you and it's not going to bother you whatsoever, especially if you just made a bunch of lather with it. Now I did use this with a shave cream, which was already soft and a little bit lathery anyway, but I don't see this not working and not lathering your typical hard bar shave soap. Now how this feels on the hand is pretty good. The metal cap on the end actually isn't too heavy, so it gives it a nice balance and nice feel in the hand. And to be honest with you, I really do like that wood handle. It just feels right. Now, is this brush worth your money? Well, it comes in at $33, which isn't the most expensive brush by far, but it's not exactly the cheapest either. However, due to the sandalwood handle and the weight of it and just how well it makes nice lather and how it feels when you apply that lather, I would have to say that it's worth that money, especially because you're probably going to be able to use it for quite a long time before needing to replace it. Now, if you're wondering what I thought about the shave sets that it comes in, make sure to check out the playlist to the right. Underneath that is a video that you'll probably enjoy as well. And let me know down in the comment section what your favorite knot is on a shave brush. Until next time, you have a good one.